So you might be trying to figure out how you can verify your Apple ID email address on your iPhone. Now, luckily for you, this is a pretty basic process which really doesn't take too much time. However, there are a few things that you could mean by this. If you're trying to get a two-factor authentication code on the same phone that you're trying to log into, that's not really going to work out. <laughs> this is a different process. But if you're trying to go ahead and verify your Apple ID email address, what you can do is you can actually go ahead and make your way over to your settings application, just like this. And you would tap on your name, which is right up here. Now, from here, you can go and tap on the little password icon, and you can go and click on security. So in this case, if we go and click on passwords, which is sign in security, it's actually a newer option, you can click here, and from here, you will see this type of information come up. Now at the bottom, you will see automatic verification. If you actually turn this on, the iPhone that will go ahead, you know, whenever a two-factor authentication code is sent on, you won't actually have to go ahead and basically go through and sign in with a different device. And that verification stuff will automatically be enabled. And so the iPhone that you're logging in with is automatically going to be verified. And that is something that is really cool and super, super easy to do. Now, on top of that, if you do want to do that, if you want to continue on, another thing you can try doing is you can go ahead and right here where it says something like, you know, two-factor authentication, you're probably going to want to make sure that's on too. Because if you do not have two-factor authentication on side of your device, that can possibly cause some issues too. So just go ahead and you know enable two-factor authentication. Now, if you're actually trying to you know verify your Apple ID email, what you're going to want to do there is you want to go ahead and make your way over to your mail application. You can sign in with your mail app, and you can go ahead and just you know see if there's a some sort of verification email from there too that you can try logging in and fixing there too. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.